Okay, what's that supposed to mean? No, nothing. Forget it. Just do me a favor and don't call me for a while. A long while. I got better things to do than spending my time feeding you information while you pretend to stare at my chest. How do you know I don't just do this so I can see you? What are you looking at? Rum running in my cabs? Do my cabs too, you know. That like it shows the way you oh, treat me. Shut up! Are you drinking again? No, Are you I cheating told you, on me? No, no, I never done nothing wrong, except for the rum thing. I oh, mean. the rum thing! Your big plan. Why? For the company. All right. We're not making the kind of money at this cab racket as you take me. Oh here, no, woman. no! I do the books. Okay, the company's doing just fine. Cause I'm bringing in the money. It's from the booze. It's not from the fares. The cabbies get a cut and we get the rest. Why didn't you tell me? Well, it's not like we've been exactly close now, is it? <sighs> I did it for us. Oh, Ned. What do you got us into? We should go to the police. You kidding me? I could go to jail. No, 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 no. We can't go to the cops. Buys, if, if we don't go to the cops, the beatings will never stop. I made one little mistake, all right? I knew they were shipping in booze from St. Pierre, so I hijacked the shipment. <gasps> You ripped off rum runners. That would explain the beatings. Look, we sold all the stuff we robbed. Everybody wanted more. The phone kept ringing off the hook. McCoy, McCoy. So I found a new supplier. Oh, right. The girl. The girl. Terry, do you have a mirror or what? There's no way I'd go out on you, OK? Ever. Okay, as, as sweet as that is, this Becker guy, he's serious trouble. Can you help us? Well? St. John's. <laughs> God. Just shag him at your butt. Sit down out of it, Lord God. <clears throat> if you don't know this island, there's a few points of interest. The fishing gear is the same as at home, and the boats, and the fishing. But they, they, they catch it different over here. Hmm? Dries are different. But them boys, they, they sure cooks are different. <laughs> this island, so close to home, but it's France. Never ceases to amaze me. Oh, don't get me wrong. There's a level of self-consciousness about the place. You know, it's Europe, but it's not. A Newfoundland, but it's not, eh? Bordeaux, boys. Yeah, uh, Bordeaux would be good, thanks. Not a point of interest would be uh floorboard over there. That's where a bullet nearly did in El Capone all them years ago. Some history here, boys. Capone. Him. Sid nor ye fellas there now. <laughs> Good company, what? <clears throat> Do you know why he dodged a bullet? Because Capone always stayed two steps ahead. Rum running. Country, you know, it's always been part of the fabric. Built in. Way of life, you know. Part of the heritage. The economy. Now then.
Who the hell are ye? And how stupid are ye? Come over here and sit at my table. Oh yeah! Anything happens to us, it won't be hard for the world of Flank and Stabler to know that we came over here. They've been after me for 30 years. I sense them Christmas cards. Karen! Get over here and meet your guests. My niece, Karen. A couple of the boys come over from home. Bonsoir. Bonsoir. Are you here long? We'll see. That was a foolish fight. I just shake of it. Enjoy your stay. Now, I happen to know that you are representing Ned Bishop. You come over here like a couple of cocky shaggers. He ogles my niece like it's the first woman he ever saw. But let's just enjoy the supper this evening. Well, why not? No threats. Let's. Although, I happen to know that there's a rat in Saint Pierre. A big one. And Bishop Taxi is stepping all over my business in St. John's. And what I want to know is this. Who's supplying Bishop Taxi with Saint Pierre Rome behind my back? Who's the rat? <clears throat> That's a, a good question. Ben. Quick, very quick. She's observing that. Well, I got me own ideas. <clears throat> Our um, employer, Ned Bishop, would love to uh, talk to you about that and possibly uh, a new business proposal. In person. Ha 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 ha! I can't leave here. I was born in Grand Bank and raised in St. John's. But my mother's from Marseille, see? This is as close as I'm going to get to going home to Newfoundland. I can't leave here. Well, Ned Bishop can't come over here. That's it, then. You tell Ned Bishop. If he cuts all connections for Saint Pierre, I'll consider it a meet. But here, now there. Well, it's been pleasant, gents. Monsieur. You have missed the last boat. We have lovely rooms upstairs. And only 50 euros a night. Some deal, huh? Hey, it's Nikki. Leave a message. Oh, hi, uh, Nikki. It's uh, Jake. You know, Jake Doyle. Um, uh, I, I was just, uh, you know, calling to see if, uh, you know, how you're doing and um, just... Weirdest thing, you know, I, I saw someone, uh, something, saw something today who, uh, I, that kind of, it just reminded me of you and I was... <sighs> I was just wondering how you're doing. That's all, okay? So, whatever. Yeah, bye. Dad. Where the hell are you? I just, you know, I wanted to... 